Hello, this is Nawaf from Saudi Arabia, who is in St. Bangkok Community College. We are in fall 2015, and the class is a little bit difficult. I have been struggling with some courses. It's fine to struggle with some courses, at least if you are trying to, to work hard. In this video, we talk about several things that I have been through since the first day until now. It's been a good time to take a silly classes in Bunker Hill. Also, my journey for these six weeks is awesome. I have learned a lot from my ASL classes. In this video, I will be talking about what I have learned so far in this class. <coughs> we have been giving a lot of homework, which is, which, is, which is I didn't expect. It's good to have a lot of homework to be prepared for college classes. I used to take ASL classes in my previous school, and it, it wasn't worth it, which has kept me in a little difficulty because it wasn't adaptable. So I saw the difference and the purpose of the homework. Despite the, uh, despite the homework, I tried to extol myself to work hard, so I challenged myself for the first few classes until I get used to it. We talked there was a rice at every meal. The author showed the cultural differences and the way they behave since the family is influenced by Japanese culture. Even though the family members are mixed race, they behave more like Japanese culture. For example, the way the author, the author showed uh, how, to, how to say I love you or how to, how to show love to, to, your, to your parents. In, in the article, it was like different for, uh, from American cook, American household and uh, Japanese household. In American household, they would, they would hug their parents and they say, I love you. In contrast, the in Japanese household, the author said that he only said to his parents, I love you once in his life. And, uh, and the way they, they show love to the parents by doing whatever their parents told them to do. So I noticed that Asian people are usually kind of shy and tend to like to express themselves. On the other hand, people from other countries like America, they are mostly like easygoing. They, they like to express themselves. Also, I have noticed that in all classes that I'm taking, uh, Asian, Asian people, they, they are more like to, to write than to speak. When you make Asian friends, you will recognize how they are polite and respectful. According to Middle Medic, I realize that people when they are young, they have dream jobs and they are more likely to follow their dream jobs when they get the chance. Of course, every every job has their uh, their negative and positive aspects. Being a mother sounds glamour, but what the author had experienced was really difficult to adjust to. The the author made the right decision when she when she changed her career from model to to paramedic and succeeded in it. It is always good to realize that if you are in the right job or not, nobody could blame the author when she chooses model. If I were the author, I would have followed my dream job first. Most importantly is that the author did the right thing when she changed to paramedic. In Tamag Machu is I have read about Campesinos and Campesinos life and the way that they treat each other. The article talked about the work between uh, men and women, then tried to give solutions. It is sad to uh, it's sad to know that Campesinos w were beating their wives and, and yelling at them. I agreed with everything the author, the author said in, the, in this article, except that women are working even harder than men. Women work only around their home, but but the man has to go to work then come back exhausting. The author mentioned that the, uh, the society have to change to have better life for men and women. When we talk the video Women of Hope, the video talked about how women were treated by men. They could have combined the culture and society condition in that period of time to talk about this issue. It's also talked about Hispanic people that are living in the US and the way they, they experience the English language. Moreover, I have experienced so much work and knowledge at the time. Other classes didn't give good topics uh, that is common in our life to work on it. Even though this class has so much homework, but it's helpful and give us the opportunity to work hard in all classes. It's a reading class, but it covered all the skills. Also, you get to know about other cultures when I burn up with another students from another culture. The good thing about this class is the activity that we do in class. Every class have a new format of questions to not be bored during the class. I have experienced uh, in this class hard tests and complica complicated questions and article to read. This class has challenged my assumption and others. I would say that I, th I thought this class would be easy and, and no lots of homework, but it turns out that all classes have homeworks and my thought was wrong. In this class, we are reading an articles and knew every details in it, in it. So there is nothing easy without studying. It becomes easier when we, when we, when we prepared for it. There is connection between 
classes that I'm taking in Bunker Hall. I'm taking note taking class and writing class. Both of these classes are interesting. In note taking class, we have talked about the role of women in every society. And in our reading class, we talked about role for uh, role of women in all societies, specifically in Tamag Machu Way's article. So there is a little bit, so they, they are a little bit connection con connected to each other. Bo both both classes discuss the woman issue in their life and from their perspective. Finally, I will say that I'm enjoying my classes in Bunker Hill and hope the, uh, the rest of the, of the semester goes same as the first half or even better. Everyone have their goals to achieve and I wish that I could achieve my goals with Bunker Hill. Thank you very much.